I guess the question of feminism too. Mm. That came up a lot. Like, do, do you, you get consider- a lot of that? Like, do you consider grading to women? Yeah, question. yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, the, which I already had my stance on. And at the time, like, the term white feminism didn't exist. Mm-hmm. And I wish it did because mm-hmm. it's like, okay, we have a definition of what that is. At mm-hmm. least, like, a broader understanding culturally of mm-hmm. what that is and why I never felt like I fit into it. And nowadays I can say I consider myself a postmodern feminist okay. because I don't fit into that ideal. But, like, the feminism that I saw around me didn't, it didn't include people like me. Mm-hmm. And that's why I didn't want to be associated with it. Right. And it was so hard for people to understand that. Like, well, what do you mean? I'm like, they might be positive until you talk. Right. Right. Because it's that whole idea of, you know, and uh, I've talked about this so many times and this makes me so mad. But when, when you ask that idea, that question, it's you're inherently putting the woman in the place of the victim. You're suggesting she exactly. has no, exactly. she can't make her own decisions. She can't exactly. possibly be an openly woman, uh, an exhibitionist. Like exactly. she can't enjoy these things because women can't be those things. Right. Women can only be one thing. Yep. And they can't be anything. Men can be this way and women can be this way. And this is how it is. Right. If women are this way, then they must be being forced into it. Like it just, you take away the power of a, f- a woman's choice. Yeah. When you say that. 100%. And I just want to punch.